I came across some social science research that was quite interesting. And there's my dog buddy running around crazy there, <laughs> looking for me. <laughs> um, and the science, social science research was about the effect that money has on the human psyche. And the summary is that when people are thinking about money, when that's what they have in mind primarily, they are less likely to help others they are less likely to ask for help, they are more likely to want to work alone and to play alone. In short, when people are thinking about money, they become more individualistic and less community-oriented, less other-oriented and more me-oriented. And this is why I always encourage us as we build our business to be thinking not about some money goal, which is what a lot of other marketing experts, business experts try to sell you on, is they, they try to sell you on, oh, it's the six-figure goal, or always thinking about profits, 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 right? I'm always encouraging you to think about the primary goal of how do I be of more service to my audience? And of course, the, ben the benefit of it is if you are really working on being of more service to your audience, the natural results tend to be that you get more money, right? Or that you get a sustainable amount of income. Because remember, your income comes from other people's money, right? Your income is other people's spending. So how can you build a successful business without getting to know what other people are willing to spend on and really getting to know them and know what they're looking for so that you can create or curate the products and services that they really want. So let's be careful when we learn from business experts that are always money centric and let's return to the primary aim, the primary thinking of how can I be of service. And if we do that, we tend to see that our business can work and work very well financially as well.